Oh, very good evening. Today is the three hundred first day of your Kauri blessing, and Baba wants us to step away from the influence of bad company. A bad company is not just about people, but we're going to explore what all things come into the bad company, and how we can be closer to God by avoiding these bad companies, and then pass with honor. That means this is a godly spiritual university where you get a certificate from God Himself for passing in, getting values in a life. More values and virtues, and removing vices. So, how many vices have we removed, and how many values and virtues we have earned, is what God looks at us and gives us a certificate. So, let's see what exactly is this all about. So, Papa says, may you always have the fortune of being close to the Father, by. Staying away from the influence of bad company, and thereby pass with honors. Let's get into the details. So Baba says, if you would like to stay close to the Father, Supreme God Father, because He is the one who is a purifier, He is the one who cleanses our past karmas, removes our sins. It doesn't mean that we keep on sinning and then asking for forgiveness. No, it doesn't work like that. Sins are removed once we take the right path and we get connected to Him. We follow His guidance and direction. We think, we see, we hear, we speak only divine, no evil. Then our past sins are cleansed. So, if you would like to stay close to the Father, stay away from the influence of bad company. Many types of papers will come in the form of attraction. So, God will also give us tests. He'll test us whether I am getting attracted to this or I am getting attracted more to God. Whether I am using shortcuts in my life to attain name, fame, money, and power, or I love God's given love, power, blessings, and the name which He gives me, and I become popular in His eyes, as compared to other people's eyes. So then God says, many types of papers will come in the form of attraction, but do not be attracted by them. There are influences of now. What are those things? There are influences of many types of company. There is the company of waste thoughts. How will it happen? Who will do it? When will it happen? Where will it happen? How? When? Where? What? Who? So all these questions lead to waste thoughts. But we have faith in God. God will get it done. Provided I am on the right direction, I am on the right path, then God will help me out, and He'll send me help from anybody or anything. So that faith is there. Then the questions are removed. So then, Baba says there is the company of waste thoughts, thoughts of attraction to Maya, lust, anger, greed, ego attachment. We get attracted to these kind of thoughts in our mind, and we keep on using them, and we remove our fate of doing good karmas and being closer to God. So if we use lustful, angry, greedy, egoistic attachment form of thoughts every single time, then how will we be in love with God? Then God says there is the Company of waste thoughts, thoughts of attraction to Maya. The company of relatives. What will relatives say if I don't listen to them? What will relatives think if I don't eat this? If I don't wear this? If I don't go there? What will they think? So they'll try to pull us away from godly influence and bring us to their influence. That is what Kali is all about. You see, that is what the test paper is all about. So in the end, whom do we make? Our closest companion. Whom do we let win, them or God the Father? That's a paper which comes to us. Then Baba says, the company of words. Words means some words they look very attractive. Some thing flattery about you. Somebody flat speaks out flattery about you. So you get attracted to the flattery. Either you speak flattery or you get attracted to flattery. It should never be a business of a child of God. They don't speak flattery about others and they don't get attracted to flattery. So words also should not influence us. The company of impure food, drinking, smoking, non-vegetarian food. God says that. So company of food also, something which can affect you and take you away from me. And the company of actions, the kind of actions which we do. We look at somebody who's getting into name and fame quickly or earning a lot of funds and earning a lot of money, and then we are like, okay, let me take that shortcut. That f- looks better to me. God says, in that you do certain karmas in which other people get hurt. You might be gaining a lot, but then God says, in the end, it's the influence of wrong karmas also. So those who 
protect themselves from the influence of all of these types of company pass with honors in whose eyes god's eyes so i hope you understand what has been spoken over here and before you sleep at night just read this over contemplate about this what things you have to change in your own life and for further details in depth do visit brahma kumari scholarly special university next door to you in your own city somewhere have a blessed good night om shanti